So we're here at Rome Ranch and we're about to see how regenerative ranching actually works. This is why I love force of nature meats so much. We're actually going to be able to see the animals, how they eat, how they live, and really the sacredness that this closed organic cycle creates for all animals. So check this out with us. So this is some of the bison fur on the hide and birds actually use this to fortify their nests. It's super hot in Texas right now. So behind me, you'll see that a lot of these bison are actually shedding their coats. So they don't pass out from the heat. I think one of the, the coolest things about these animals too, and particularly being here at, at Rome Ranch in Fredericksburg is that the native range of the American bison would have been from Mexico all the way up into Canada. And yet we've wiped those herds uh, off of the, the native landscapes in, in, in devastating numbers. And it was really cool and really special to get to bring these animals back onto this land for the first time in several hundred years so they could do the really important work that they do and fulfill their potential in healing land. All right, so these bison are our greatest conservation tools. Everything about how they have biologically been engineered, it's the perfect design in Mother Nature's image. So they're hoofs, they're spade shaped. They break up cap soil, which allows rainfall to infiltrate. It allows new seeds to germinate. Their mere presence, so the bite of that grass plant right there, when we move this animal, there's a biome in its mouth that's gonna stimulate that grass to grow back further, stronger, and more resilient. You know, they're composting machines. This herd puts out about 5,000 pounds of poop a day. Now that's a lot that gets cycled back into the soil, feeds the biology within the soil, and that biology then feeds the plants, which is very cyclical because then these animals receive the benefit of that closed loop system. And then as end consumers, we receive the benefit of healthy, thriving soil, the fixation of vitamins and minerals and the nutrients that are passed through to, uh, to the meat. This animal here burrows in that manure and pulls it into the earth. And within just a couple of days, that manure is gonna be gone. So if you see petrified, you know, one year, two year old manure out in the pasture, which is very common, that's because there's no biology in the soil. So this is why it's important to eat meat that actually eats quality earth that is fed by the sun and doesn't have a bunch of chemicals inside of it. Because the truth is that whatever you eat, you also eat whatever it ate. And that's why I love regenerative ranching.